Hey, it's John here with Inspectflix, and in this video I want to describe coarse uh, air furnaces and water heaters that are using propane LP gas. So in areas that do not have the availability of natural gas for the appliances and mechanics, uh, people will often go to the other option, which is electric, propane, LP gas, or even fuel oil in some cases. So um, what I wanted to explain to you is, is when coarse aired furnaces uh, are typically manufactured for natural gas. And so you just can't take a furnace and install it uh, and connect it with propane LP gas. So what a heating contractor has to do is they have to go into where the burners are and take off the orifice that the gas releases into the heat exchanger. And they it changes the size of the porthole where the gas actually goes through. So I have the original one sitting right here from the manufacturer. So this is what that burner looks like. And they basically just thread and screw right onto the end of that burner and that's where the gas goes through to create the flame. Um, so whenever you're seeing a furnace that's using LP, you definitely want to make sure that those orifices for the burners are converted. So when a heating contractor does that, they even change and put a, a label, right, a sticker right on top of the gas control valve indicating that this is propane gas. Um, so that's a very good example. Also, when you look at the flame, um, you should have a nice even blue flame. Typically, propane burns even a brighter blue, so it's a completely different gas. Now, on the water heater, those typically come designed for propane, so you must request for it to be propane, not natural gas, as far as the setup goes. So now, if you look at the label here closely, they actually indicate it on the types. So if you look, it says gas, and then it has LP. So that tells you that this is set up for propane gas.